Okay, so I was going to do some experiments with cavity structure effect, and I just got some plastic straws, and I have my special detector here, which I'm going to, let's, let's just charge this up with my hands, like I normally do. So I'm going to put psychotronic energy into this torsion pendulum. Okay. Get it good and charged up. Okay, it starts twisting, so I know that it's charged up when it's twisting. And I'll take my straws here, and let's just get them all about the same height here. And I'll just take these straws, I guess, and point it at one side of the pendulum. Okay, let me point it at the other side. Oh, it's attracting now. A second ago it was repelling. It seemed like it was repelling earlier. Okay. Seems to be fairly strongly attracting the pendulum. See that? I'll move it over to the other side. Now this is a Faraday cage it's inside of. So it should not be seeing any electrostatic fields due to this guy. I wonder if I turn it around, what happens? Oh, wow, that's interesting. Now it's repelling if I turn it that way. What is the difference? So I'll see, I flip the straws over. And now it's attracting on this side. <laughs> How weird. Okay, I think the charge is wearing down. Maybe it's because of where I'm holding it with my hand or something. I was holding it with my other hand, maybe. Let's try that. Okay, come on. Get these things. Okay, so now I'm holding it with my left hand, and it seems to be repelling the torsion pendulum. See that? It's repelling it. Oh, very interesting, huh? I think the charge is worn down, so let me let me just try recharging it again. Okay. Okay, so I believe the, the term that they used to describe this was CSE or cavity structure effect. And that was uh uh gr grin oh shoot. Gray Gribin Grim uh Grebinikov, the Russian researcher who was uh, doing research with uh, bug wings and anti-gravity and such. And uh, I've been watching Alexei, Alexei's Garage, which is a Russian inventor who uh, seems to have a, quite a bit of really interesting uh, anti-gravity type topics. Okay, so I think we're charged up again. And let me Grab these straws with my left hand this time. And it seems like the torsion pendulum is attracted to it now. Look at that, how strongly it's attracted to that. Very strongly, look at that. Okay. Okay, so let me turn this around the other way and see if it's repelled now. Oh, it seems to be attracted now to that side. Okay. Well, let's change hands and see what happens, I guess. Put the straws down. And we'll grab it with the other hand. Okay. And so now, oh, look at that. It's on the right hand and it's strongly repelled by it. See it? Right hand here, just holding the straws. And it seems to be very strongly repelled by it now. If I push on that side, it turns away from it. Bring the straws over to this side of the pendulum. And it seems to also be repelled. Let's see. Let's see if we can get a good view of the 
this thing. Okay. Seems to be producing a force this way, so it's repelled by it. I'm holding it with my right hand. And this is again through a Faraday cage, so it's definitely definitely not electrostatic fields. Anyway, the charge kind of wears down after a while. Okay. Anyway, very interesting, huh? So it looks like this uh, uh, cavity structure effect is a real effect. And this is Dr. James, and thanks for watching.